Welcome to Mechanical Tutorial. I am going to teach you different techniques in SOLIDWORKS for mechanical engineers. I am going to train you different modules like part modeling, surface modeling, sheet metal enclosure design, plastic components design, product design, reverse engineering, simulation and many more tips and tricks in SOLIDWORKS. Hi, today I am going to explain about sheet metal clamp. It is similar to muffler clamp. See, I have taken the inspiration from this component. and this is the component looks like so I'm going to create this component so let's start now so I've taken a new SOLIDWORKS part file select the right plane select center point arc draw one arc from the center and uh, draw one center line so the radius is uh, 50 draw one line so tangent is this arc draw midpoint line select this make it vertical and construction distance between center and this point is 36 Now once again select the center point arc and draw from here. And select these two endpoints make it tangent. So we try to join this and select this and make it tangent. And uh, the radius is 15 we have to draw one line see the this line and this line should be parallel then move little bit inside and select this point draw an arc that is 3 mm see here this is the 3 mm and uh, the length is 20 and uh, this line is 80 so in future we are going to make a symmetric so select the mirror entities select all the four entities mirror about this center line and say ok See here we have to move this line this point and join this here and the distance between this center and this center is 90 see finally we have to select this origin and this point so since we have joined this midpoint line so it should be symmetric so we have to make it horizontal so this sketch is constrained see there is an option in show hide we can hide relations 
so while creating sketch we can show this and also we can hide this so this is the final sketch select this sketch go to the base flange and select mid plane it's 40 mm depth and thickness is uh, 2 mm and radius is 2 mm so k factor should be 0.45 should be always less than 0.5 so i'm going to hide these sketches select this face go to unfold collect all bends and say ok so I am going to create this cutout so select this face go to sketch draw one slot straight slot select the midpoint make it vertical so the distance between these two endpoints is 90 so draw one center line for mirror this sketch this is 310 distance between two end points these two lines is uh, 15 so this sketch is constrained now so we have to mirror this so select the mirror entities select the slot select the center line say ok in sheet metal module extruded cut we have to link to thickness and say ok so this slot has been created now so we have to fold this select fold command collect all bands and say ok see here the component is ready so this is how we create this kind of components so this is brief about uh, sheet metal clamp, thanks for watching.